my name is Sandy Ikes. Uh, I am the director of STEM learning at Science World, and I've been part of Squist since the late 90s. I first joined Squist um, sometime after I moved to BC to be a grad student. I'm pretty sure the first introduction I had to Squist was at one of the very first Wonder Women nights, which were then called Double X Evenings. Um, uh, it was at Science World. I wasn't at Science World at the time. I was a grad student at SFU. And I ran into some um, terrific folks from Squist. I was looking for ways to volunteer with kids around STEM learning. You know, it's, it's such a vague memory. I went because I was part of a group at SFU that was um, trying to support uh, women in physics, and uh, especially in women in science. And I think we all went as, as a group. Um, but it's, it's hard to look back at that now because I'm so familiar with both Squist and Science World, it's hard to look back and remember, you know, seeing that for the first time. Um, but it was a great opportunity to meet other women in science. Um, usually, in, in the before times, um, the Wonder Women evenings are big noisy networking evenings, uh, mostly for undergraduate women and women who are changing careers uh, with, I don't know, maybe three dozen role models, and maybe 150 participants, um, everybody talking at once, eating pizza, getting to know each other, hearing each other's stories. Um, usually it's a big, noisy, crowded thing. Um, we've had everything happen from people getting jobs, uh, which is sort of a, a pretty amazing um, opportunity. But the, over the years, the main thing that's happened is that folks have been sort of inspired by the stories of women who have careers in STEM. They've had opportunities to, to understand that it's not always a straight career path, um, that, it, that there are many, many ways to um, follow a career trajectory in STEM. And I think people get inspired, people meet each other, um, and, you know, in the rare occasion, people find their next job. So uh, COVID, of course, makes it impossible to have an event where you've got 200 people in a room having simultaneous conversations and eating pizza all at once. So this year we took the Wonder Woman event online and we did it over Zoom, which uh, meant we had to structure the event a little bit more tightly. It wasn't quite as, as free form. It wasn't quite as long. But what it did mean was that we were able to involve both participants and mentors from Central Canada. So we had um, folks in Ontario and Quebec joining us as well. Um, it was an incredibly successful event to the point where we're talking about having it more often than once a year. People participated really strongly. The Wonder Women were really glad to be there. So yeah, great, great feedback. Squist is connection. It's about connecting women with similar interests and connecting ex women with experience in STEM to women who want to have experience in STEM. Mm -hmm.